Hey, it's Jill with Crick Flex, and I finally got my um, Nerd Mickey, Minnie, Daisy, and Donald um, done. And so what I'm going to do now is I have them all put together. They are all 15 inches tall. Um, and when I was talking about my having to take them apart and recolor them because the resolution was so low, um, I did do the video where I showed how I started to cut them apart. Um, and basically, I cut the pants apart, the hands, the bow tie, everything. And then just colored them and, and piled one thing on top of another. And this is how they came out. He is larger than the mat, so the cut is under the neck on each one of the each one of the pieces so that I could get the 15. Now what I'm going to do is take each one of the pieces and just add a couple final touches. On Mickey, what I'm going to do is get my little come here guy. I'm going to add some um, some of my metal little pieces here to his pants, his buttons for starters with my eye rock and my pick me up that is a silhouette um, made by silhouette. I'm going to put a couple buttons on each side of his pants and while that's heating up I'm also going to take and do a little bit um, of, I have a silver pen here and I'm just going to add a little bit to the shoes to kind of make them pop out and I hope my pen's not going out on me and I think what I'll do here is do a little laces and again this is just with my pen um, this is a um, rolling ball silver that I got at um, Michael's and I love it because it it glides so smoothly. Let me put these on here. The, whoops! Run away little bling. Get back here. And put that back where it goes. And that where it goes. Then what I think I'm going to do for him, again, these, I'm going to try and get them as nerdy as I possibly can and just add my little extras. Oops, wrong pen. I'm going to add another little silver button on the other side and grab another one for over here. Whoops, got a little bit of a runaway here on the the gummy part of my little pick-me-up stick here. Okay, that's going to be that for him. And then I'm going to take and draw the line on his shoe and draw a line over here. Then again, I'm going to do just draw out my laces. Then I'm going to go back and take some baker's twine and make some shoelaces. Okay, now I'm going to grab my little bow maker here and grab some black twine and some yellow twine accidentally and tie my laces here. I'm going to make the laces on my little bow thing here um, one inch um, because he's small and I'm going to need four of them for each side and here's my good scissors and there's one lace and there we go and this bow maker, like I've said in previous videos, is a godsend when it comes to making these little tiny, tiny bows. And you can take and make one yourself just drilling holes in a piece of wood um, with your drill bit that, of course, would match in size as your 
um, dowel rods. Just plain old dowel rods, that's all it is. There we go. And, oh, I tell ya. I put them all together first and got them ready so that this video hopefully isn't unbelievably long. My last one that I did um, when I was working on whatever project I just finished, I can't even remember. Um, the video is taking forever to upload. Um, I tell you, I probably have more videos. I use iMovie. And I would probably even have more videos out there have, if it wasn't for iMovie being so unbelievably slow. I don't know, something happened on that. So let me put this aside. And I'm going to take a little itty bitty dab of hot glue that I turned off. Not good. I'll move this aside till the hot glue is heated up. Some of the other things I'm, I'm going to be doing, let me grab Daisy. I'm going to do her first. Here's Daisy, and I added a, an Argyle trim to her sleeves on her shirt and the tie, and I wanted to add laces to her as well, but I'm also going to be adding bling to her um, glasses. I don't know what kind of bling. Right here, I think I'll use this. Let's see here. Yeah. You know what? I think I had, let me grab my bling tray here. There, that's the one I want. I'm going to do these circles instead. All of my bling is Recollections um, from Michaels. Love it. These are circle. I got too much stuff on my desk right now. This is the first time I've worked on a project where I've had this much stuff out at once. But these are... These are perfect, I think, for a finishing touch on Daisy, Nerd Daisy. And then I am also, while my gun is heating up here, I am going to put some shoelaces on her, but I'm not going to draw out the lines like I did on Mickey. I'm just going to make some bows and Normally on my um, typical Daisy Duck uh, in minis, I use bling, lots of bling. But since these guys are supposed to be total nerds, I don't think blue bling all over her shoes would be too nerdy. So I'm just going to put um, shoelaces. However, let's see here. To do four of these, I should have been done these before I started filming. You know what, maybe I'll pause the camera and get all my bows tied together so that you don't have to sit here and watch me tie bows. And when I'm done, I will come back and finish up. And do I need some for her? Yes, let me tie my bows and then I'll be back. Hi, I'm back again. Um, anyway, you probably never even noticed I was gone. So... Um, I finished doing all my bows, but I, I made a little bit of a change. Um, I have a whole thing of bows here that I made eons ago um, that I had resurrected from my stash. So I decided to use these because these are already all folded. I need four pink ones for her. So, let's see here. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and glue those on. And glue gun's hot now so I can finish up Mickey. And I'll finish up her first since I'm, I've got her going here. Then I took and I have a, oh it's about a one and a half, one and three quarter inch wide ribbon. Um, that's got wire in it that I absolutely love because then you can bend it and shape it the way you want. And I'm going to add that to the bow in her hair. Again, I'm all about adding textures and 
just adding little bits of extra so that my pieces aren't just flat. And let's see here. I'm going to hold that down for a minute. Got the round bling on here. I got the bows on her feet. And I think that that should be dry. And I don't want to smash the bow. <clears throat> so I'm going to kind of flip her over this way so that I don't smash the bow on her hair. It's hanging off on my lap. Bow on the shoe. And another bow on the shoe. And I'll do Mickey's laces. And there we go. And the bow for her. She's got a bow in her hair already, but you know what? It's going to be bow on top of a bow. It's the layered look. That's what everybody... Um, did years ago and if you were to do that now you would be totally considered a nerd. Well maybe not. I better not be starting to make fashion statements um, at my age because I have no clue. Oh I forgot the little round blingy things. Oh you I've got bins here of maybe buttons and bling and all that kind of fun stuff. I don't use enough of it um, because if I don't see it, that is one thing that I wish I could just have everything where I could see it. I have a wheel thing on wheels here next to me with clip, clip it up full of bling and flowers and all that kind of stuff and I've got bins and bins full of pieces and I forget and then I don't use it because I forget what I have. So if I had the space I would have everything hanging all over the wall so it was looking at me every time I walked in the room because I have stuff that I will gonna have to live to be 400 before I'll use it all. Okay there we go got her. Now let me put her base back on and Whoops, pagan round hole, there we go. Now we've got Daisy. When I'm all done, I'll take some good pictures um, of these guys. I'm gonna set her up here and let me go back to him and put his laces on, his shoelaces here. Uh, again, I did them out of Baker's Twine in black and white Baker's Twine. Love that stuff. Don't use that enough either and I've got rolls and rolls of it. There we go, and there we go. Sometimes I get a little bit too much glue, a little bit more than I want. Oh, and you know what else I found? I found these styrofoam alphabets that, again, resurrected from stuff that I had eons and years ago. And you can't see, because he's got his bow tie on, but I am gonna take one of these M's and put it on his shirt, whoop, if I can get the backing off of it, like he has a letter sweater. And we can pretend he has a letter sweater because you can't really see, because the bow is so big, or there's bow tie. Well, we're gonna try and add this M if I can get the backing off. M, now that can be either be for Mickey or for Minnie. But, don't get much nerdier than that. Oh, let me flip him over and grab this bow and dab a little glue on and stick that down there. And bow number two. I shouldn't say bow, this is actually a shoelace, not a bow. To shoelace. There we go. Got them both done and we're going to add the M on him over here. Okay. Then Mickey will be done. I just checked and my iMovie is still finishing up. 
I don't know why it's so unbelievably slow to do that. I know it's not my internet connection, but... And for those of you that were watching and saw me whining and moaning and just carrying on and on and on about not having internet, um, I'm not going to tell you what it was since I do do that for a living. I um, should have caught it myself. But anyway, um, this kind of doing these iMovies takes forever to load. Now, what I'm going to do on Donald here is I have these Sparkle Burst Brads. They're made by Karen Foster. And they almost look like... Um, windmill things like from the fairs or whatever I am gonna put those on the corner of his glasses since he's got this nerdy cap on with the pinwheel on the top of it um, I think that these really um, will nerdy up his glasses to match so I'm not real sure if they're Brad's oh they're Brad's poop because I've already put him together. Let me see how I can do this because I can't poke him through now. So I might have to resort to something else unless... Well, you know what I'm going to do? I am going to cut the brad off. There we go. They're no longer brads. Ha! How nerdy can that be? Poor Donald. He should be embarrassed running around with these super nerdy glasses. Okay, now, what do I do with them? Here they are. And I want the gray ones because they don't have any sparkles really. A little bit, but not much. Ooh, I almost used my good scissors to cut that off. That would not have been good. I suppose I should have tried to flatten it before I had over that too. There we go. I'm not going to do much else to him. Because I couldn't think of anything since he doesn't have shoes on. I'm not going to put laces on him. I'm just going to put those. Can't. Um, let me get these two ready to flip him over. And put two more on. Don't want that one too glittery. I guess I'll use this one. I guess I'm going to have to use one glittery one. But cut those off. And... Cut that off. There we go. Am I ever making a mess? Normally, I do not try not to make a terrible mess when I'm crafting because it distracts me. But I'm on a mission today to get a bunch of stuff done. And so cleaning between um, projects is not taking a precedence. Or it's not taking a priority over what I do. Um, I just want to get as much done today as I can. So, I don't know what those are. Oh, those are some of my... I don't want to throw those away. Those are my little button things that I put on his pants. Let me put those back in the, the jar. Okay. This... Um, I rock thing. I love it. Okay. Donald's done. He's got his little pinwheel hat on. And now he's got his little nerdy glasses. Put him over there. And we are going to finish up with Minnie. Now, Minnie also has a bow in her hair. And I... I'm going to put some, let me see if these are too red. They're fine. It'll work for me. I'm going to put some bows on her shoes. Let me see. Let me see. Yeah. And these bows, I'm going to tell you, were tied and put together on the wood crafting that I used to do that was at least 15 years ago. Oh, <gasps> you know what I'm going to do? I am going to put a pocket, a pen pocket on Donald. 
I got these little squares of fabric, these little patches. I'm going to put a pen pocket on him. Or what are they called? Um, pocket protector? I'm going to put a pocket on his shirt, whatever. And maybe I'll take some little toothpicks and paint them as pencils and stick them in that pocket. That way it'll add just a little bit more to him. Flip her over and put her laces on the, or her bows on the other side. And I wish I had some stories to tell you. I didn't have the grandkids this weekend, so I don't even have any fun stories to tell. Kind of boring. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, and then I made these ribbons um, out of this ribbon that also was from Michael's. Um, it's actually a Christmas ribbon, but it's just red and gold, and I'm totally okay with it because it kind of um, sets off the color that I used on her dress. So I'm going to add that on top of her bow. Bow in the bow. I'm not going to put anything on her glasses because each corner of her glasses here has Mickey, a Mickey head. So I'm not going to add anything, but I am going to puff this bow up a little bit. I flattened it. I love the bow that has a little bit of wire in it. It's awesome. It's awesome to puff up. Okay, there we go. And that takes care of her. And let me put her on her stand. There we go. There's Minnie. I'm going to grab him back. And I'm going to have to use my tape here and tape these pockets on his. If I get the tape to stick, I think it did. I don't want to put hot glue because hot glue will make it all lumpy. There we go. There we go. And then I'm going to take some still shots here for you so you can see them all done. And it's not real easy putting tape on top of these little tiny pieces, I'll tell you that. I think I got it. I did, I did indeedy. There we go. He's got a little pocket on his shirt now. So let me get all of them down here. I'll show you a picture, and then I will go and take some good pictures. The nerds. Here we go. And there is Minnie and Donald and Mickey and Daisy. At least this time I got the names right. I can't believe how often I go back and listen to my videos later. And boy, I tell you what, what, I get the names wrong all the time. So I did pretty good. I got the names right tonight. So now I'm going to take some still shots for you and I will post this next. Thank you. Have a good night.